Good morning. I hope all is well with you. I know everything is well with me up to this point. Um, although it is only hmm, 7.51 in the morning uh, a.m. Um, listen, this is going to sound like a commercial. However, this product here, it's called Spray and Forget, is absolutely awesome at getting rid of mold. If you have vinyl siding, I used to have to power wash my shed twice a year to get green mold off of it. Um, I would use bleach concentrate or bleach uh, uh, products to try to clean it and scrub it and it would just come back. This product here, after the initial um, application, you wait approximately four to six weeks and you'll see it's gone. Um, initially, you'll have to do it twice a year. But then after that, you only need to do it one time a year and it's reactivated by apparently the rain. You cannot put it down when it's going to rain within the next 72 hours. You mix it five to one as the strongest concentration and I use the roof cleaner concentrate because that's all that I've ever used and it works so I don't believe in fixing it if it doesn't work. You can buy this at Home Depot. It costs uh, approximately 40 bucks a gallon, although today it's probably $50 a gallon, who knows. Um, but I will show you uh, a picture of a retaining wall that I have tried to clean we're using everything from bleach to all kinds of natural uh, uh, ingredients to try to kill this mold. Um, I've used a power washer and unfortunately all that does is it does somewhat clean it but it also removes all the texture from the brick on the um, retaining wall but in reality all of the mold and mildew is still there in the nooks and crannies and is back with a vengeance shortly thereafter. With this product I uh, uh, sprayed it on and in the beginning I had to do it twice a year but now once a year I can take a day and um, well half a day and spray the whole retaining wall mix this and spray the whole retaining wall and um, it lasts for a year same thing with uh, anybody that has uh, Noga hide or vinyl or whatever on their boat and it winds up getting um, all kinds of green or black um, especially if you uh, don't keep your boat covered but it is covered in a, uh, a boathouse but it can allow the condensation to um, sit on the uh, vinyl uh, it'll turn green and black and I used to use soft scrub and then I got cheating and I started spraying with a concentration of uh, water and bleach or a mixture of water and bleach however that ruins the um, stitching and after 20 years it ruined all the seats and I last year I had to replace all the seats in a boat in a little pontoon boat and uh, now I just actually spray this on there and when I come down it's nice and clean. Once a year I uh, do in fact spray that on the um, Naga hide vinyl leather, well not leather, but <clears throat> and come down and it's clean. Um, I can't speak highly in, uh, in enough about how well this product works. And no, it's not an ad for it. No, I don't own any part of that company. And uh, I just like it. Uh, thank you. Bye.